Live new at five, a showdown in Nowata County. The sheriff and most of her staff resigning today after a judge ordered her to reopen the jail. Now the jail hasn't housed inmates since that carbon monoxide leak a few weeks ago forced them to evacuate. Two Works Fuse Ashley Wheeler is live at the Nowata County Courthouse tonight to tell us what happens next. Ashley. Well, Karen, the sheriff, the undersheriff and multiple deputies all resigned today. But this afternoon, a judge said that their resignation was void. Now, the judge this morning ordered the sheriff and the undersheriff to bring all of the inmates back to this county jail. The inmates have been housed in the Washington County Jail since the carbon monoxide incident at the end of February. But Sheriff Terry Sue Barnett refused to bring them back, saying the jail isn't safe for inmates or employees. Sheriff Barnett resigned, but the judge has ordered her to stay on the job and get the Inmates back inside. I do not work for the judge. The judge is an elected official. I'm also an elected official. I do not believe that we live in a country where I can be ordered to go to work after I've already tendered my resignation. The judge says the court could take further action if the sheriff and undersheriff do not return back to work. Now, we did try talking with the judge, but the court clerk said he refuses to comment on an ongoing case. Both the sheriff and the undersheriff are due back in court tomorrow morning, and we will let you know what happens then. We also have the sheriff's resignation letter on our website with the eight reasons why she decided to step down today. Reporting live in Nevada, Ashley Wheeler, Two Works For You.